here is uh, Tucker Carlson claiming that um, he's having, I mean, can you imagine like having a guest on about the Rittenhouse uh, shooting? Murder. And, um, and not really sort of boning up on it at all. That would be weird to me. But that's what Tucker Carlson's doing here. Johnson, uh, you know, oh, Kyle, the only second. individuals. I should just tell you, I should tell you, this is, this is Rittenhouse's lawyer. Lawyer, right. This is the attorney for Kyle Rittenhouse explaining his defense. That's unbelievable. That Kyle shot were the three individuals that were attacking him and putting right. him at risk of serious bodily harm or death. This is a 17-year-old kid. This is, this no. is amazing. So let me what ask you did. this, and I think that's a, that's a fair point. He didn't shoot indiscriminately, and in, in, I'm taking your word for it in the first one because I, I haven't seen the video, but the, in the second two, I have seen the video. One guy attacked him, the other guy was pointing a gun at him. That's Here's right. my question. He shot that man in yes. the arm and the man backed off. That man survived. That man has not been charged. He came at a 17-year-old with a gun. Why has he not been charged? So here's a question that I have, Tucker. Um, where, where are the charges for aggravated assault against Kyle Rittenhouse? Where are the charges for arson in our cities? Where are the charges for rioting? Where, where, where are the charges for crossing state lines? And where are the charges against Whoa. the people who are funding this activity uh, and, 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 and who are financing it? And, and why is Kyle Rittenhouse a, a 17 year old lifeguard who is attempting to protect the businesses in his community and attempting to help wounded protesters and was protecting his own life while Kenosha was burning? Why is he the one sitting in jail tonight as forces within this country sickeningly attempt to find a way to bring harm to him while he's in detention? It is sickening. Oh, it's so Thanks sickening. For coming on tonight and giving your side of this, which has not been heard. I haven't heard it anyway. So I, <laughs> Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> yeah. It's not going to be in court. It's not admissible to court because it's a lie because there's video footage because he murdered two people. Are you well, effing he didn't see, kidding he me? Didn't see, he didn't see the first video. I didn't, I didn't see the first video <laughs> of the first killing. That, that one I didn't want to see. <sighs> and then, of course, like, you know, Rittenhouse was, of course. Uh, now, my understanding is that Rittenhouse is from Illinois. Crossing what, like, state lines. His community uh, was being protected. I don't wonder what he means by his community. Right. Um, uh, he's in the diaspora of uh, Kenosha in Illinois. Uh, but uh, his, uh, I, I don't know if he felt like it, his community is like just fellow gun-toting white people. But the idea, like, he's a 17-year-old kid. I mean, you imagine, like, com contrast this. Um, uh He's a 17 year old kid. I mean, yes, granted, he had a weapon and he was geared up and he was there um, uh, brandishing this weapon with no sign on his shirt. Like, I'm only 17. I'm just, I have, like, I, it's unbelievable to me that they think they can get away with this, but they are getting away with it within their own people. It's just a question of, like, how narrow is that? And again, it's like, you know, the, the lawyer said, and I don't I don't understand. I think the lawyer strategy is simply a, a messaging strategy, not an actual legal strategy, because he's sitting there saying, oh, what about the people crossing state lines with guns? What about an underage kid crossing state lines alone? Where were his parents? Why weren't they, you know, when, why was he allowed to go over state line with a gun? Same exact argument. You can't you just it, it's not going to hold up, hopefully, in a court of law. Um, I don't know. I mean, this is this is really horrifying. Sam. I like, would love to compare and contrast their response to Trayvon Martin when they talk about as a kid. He's just a kid. A kid. He's mm -hmm. just a 17 year old kid with a semi-automatic weapon. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. It's it, Sam. Don't you know it's more dangerous if there's a kid in a hoodie walking down the street? Just Sk with Skittles. Yeah. Skittles. Yeah.